All right. If you guys go ahead and take a look at this problem, um, again, to identify vertical asymptotes, we want vertical asymptotes, remember, are removable, or I'm sorry, are non removable discontinuities, right? So they're where, in a rational function, they're where the denominator is going to be equal to zero. Um, and we can't remove them. Well, fortunately, in this problem, there's nothing really we can factor. So my vertical asymptote is going to be when my denominator is equal to zero for all the values that make my denominator equal to zero. However, when I go ahead and solve, I get x equals plus or minus i. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the domain, remember our definition of domain, the set of all values, real numbers that make that are true for the function. Is plus or minus i a real number? No. So it doesn't, it, our function is undefined for an imaginary number. We don't really care. We only care when the function is undefined for real numbers. So therefore, there is no vertical asymptote under our real numbers. Okay? So no vertical asymptote exists. There's an imaginary vertical